，全世界最贵的艺术家之一的作品就在你家楼下摆着。哦，所以我也不知道这个格林威治半岛他们是有什么魔力，能让全英国最贵的艺术家把他最多的艺术作品全都搬到这里来。位于东南伦敦的格林威治半岛现在是伦敦最有艺术氛围感的地区之一，整个半岛就像一个免费的艺术展览馆，融汇了色彩缤纷的艺术装置，吸引了大量爱好者来此打卡。而今天呢，我们就请到了负责整个半岛艺术装置的两位策展人姐姐 Jemima 和 Kaya， 让他们带我们看看这里的艺术作品。I'm introducing Jemima. I'm Jemima and I am curator of Now Gallery, and I also am involved with art projects throughout Greenwich Peninsula. It's my colleague. Yeah, I'm Kalia. I'm the senior cultural projects manager at Greenwich Peninsula, and、um, with Jemima, we work on a lot of cultural projects. So these two curators are very good. Why does the Berlin Wedge Bandar look so cool and so artistic? Actually, it's all their hard work behind the scenes. So I think they are the ones who determine the quality of the two Bandar artists. 艺术家，所以今天我们也非常荣幸啊，让二位艺术家亲自带着我们来领略一下这个格林威治半岛所有的艺术作品。好，我们现在开始。So we were, I was saying, this one really looks like the Tibetan Buddhism, like the pattern. Yes. So this, the whole artwork here is by an artist called Muragaya, and we commissioned it to celebrate the South Asian festival of Diwali. So Diwali takes place in November. I see. But we've chosen to do it in a very contemporary way. This is great, and so people can walk through it, no problem. It is. You can walk through it, and also at night, yeah, the central node comes to light. So all of these fantastic metallic surfaces will start to shimmer at night. 格林威治半岛真的是一个神奇的地方。那今天我们做采访的时候，正好在这儿看到了这个艺术作品的艺术家本人。Thank you so much. So tell us about what's behind your idea of this flower petals. Of course, yeah. So this、uh, sculpture is called Rangoli Mirrored Cosmos, and it's a sculpture that is a 3D reinterpretation of a Rangoli. And, and for us, Asian, don't understand Rangoli. What is it? Of course, yeah. So in in South Asian culture, during the festival of Diwali, the festival of light. Um, South Asian people put rangoli flowers, which are normally these powder-coated flowers in the entrances of their homes,、uh, to ward off bad spirits and bring in good spirits. And this is simply a three-dimensional version of that. This is a 3D flower that、uh, lights from the from the center, and it kind of emits light and it invites warmth and contemplation. Thank you so much. I feel very honored to have the artist himself to tell us about the art. Thank、You're、you so, so much. Thank yeah, you very thank much. You. Thank you. I've been here like several times over the years. The artwork it changes, but all the time very colorful.、Yes. So I was wondering why there's a, such a bold color. It's, 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 it's not even London like. You know? <laughs> I suppose we are a new part of London. We、yeah. have very fresh ideas,、yeah. and、um, we tend to look at color. You know,、yeah. the intelligence of color、mm -hmm. through the commissions that we have. So you will see a lot of. The artworks that、um, we have commissioned explore、mm -hmm. color and light,、mm -hmm. and also scale.、Mm -hmm. So we're going to take you through lots of colorful installations.、Mm -hmm. We can go on. To... Yes, yes. So a lot of what we do is、mm -hmm. uh, enliven the transitional spaces, so that as、mm -hmm. people walk through the peninsula, they have very unique experiences,、yeah. and we place art in very unexpected places. We use a lot of the dynamic architecture、uh -huh. of the peninsula to showcase、um, different. Interpretations of art.、Um, this area is called the Tide, which is a tide. transitional bridge that takes you、uh -huh. from Peninsula Square to、uh -huh. the river. To the river. So the piece above is by Marwan Kabur, who's a Lebanese、um, uh, artist who's based in the UK.、Uh -huh. So we worked with him to commission this piece, which has taken、um, nine different poems、uh -huh. by、um, uh, poets from different backgrounds and cultures,、uh -huh. Uh -huh. and they represent the languages that are probably most spoken in Greenwich Peninsula and in Greenwich as a borough.、Uh -huh. So and all of the texts、uh, referencing the river、yeah. as well. 那别的我不认识啊，我看到了中文，那中文上面呢写了一句叫“摸着石头过河”，这个真的让我记得很清楚。So the staircase is another artist work. It is. It's by a renowned British artist called Ian Davenport.、Mm. This artwork imagines that you have poured paint from the、I、top、see. of the stairs, yes, yes. and it then pools down to the bottom. It does look so, like a waterfall of acrylic it, is coming it, down. It does. Yeah. It does. Yeah. It's really yeah, yeah. It's so colorful and it's really fascinating. But the best way to experience it is by walking up it. Yeah,、so、and taking some. <laughs> <笑>这个楼梯呢，其实是一个很有名的一个英国艺术家做的。他呢就特别擅长，就是用这个丙烯，然后去泼泼的这个各种颜色。那他的一个等于是非常有他标签的艺术，就是从上面的这个往下，就像一个颜料瀑布一样泼到底下。其实就是艺术创作它的一种无限想象的空间和不确定性，因为你永远不知道这个颜色要的走向是什么。所以这是大开脑洞的一个一个一个体验。We also wanted to say that. 
Ian Davenport's work you generally see in galleries. And what's exciting about this yes. is that you get to experience a really significant artist's work, one of the really important um, artists of his generation. And you get to see it here and the public can see it. They don't have to go into a gallery. Yes. Yes. They get to have it on, you know, underneath their feet. So the next artwork that we're going to see is mm -hmm. by Morag Myerskoff. And this piece is called Sibling. Sisters. You know, two sisters or two brothers. They mirror each other. They mirror each other. It suddenly make this place almost human-like. Yeah, I think that's a really good point. Well, I think we also we believe in humor yes. and having things that make you think a yes. little bit, make you laugh. Yeah, I, I do feel the humor behind her. Yes. So what you may know about Greenwich Peninsula is it's incredibly windy. Yes. And this piece is called Head in Wind, this figurative piece. We don't have any, so many figurative pieces mm -hmm. that you've seen so far, mm -hmm. but we feel like it's important to have people frequenting yeah. this place. Yeah. And this woman is his wife mm -hmm. and she sort of takes over the space. And what's lovely is that from here, you know, you can see her and kind of be with her and see the wind coming through her hair. Uh -huh. But also when you're in the apartment, uh -huh. you look down and you have this amazing view of this face that looks out into the peninsula. And as we're speaking, the wind is brushing over here. <laughs> this one I can understand. It is a mermaid. It is, it is. It's um, uh, part of Damien Hirst's Treasures of the Wreck of the Unbelievable. I know Damien Hirst, he's the most expensive artist in the yes, UK. Yes, contemporary artist, but what you will notice about this piece is that it, it is very similar to a classical piece yes. that you would find in a museum. Mm -hmm. And we have um, a number of artworks mm -hmm. from this collection mm -hmm. on the peninsula that is just free to view. What we particularly love about this piece is it almost looks like it's been dipped in the river. Yes. And it, yes. it's been just brought up yes. and the mermaid has kind of collected all these amazing yes. crabs yes. and that it feels like it's very much part of the peninsula, that it's, it's, it fits in so well with the river. Mm -hmm. Because现在艺术家，但是呢，啊，Damien Hirst的最多的这个现代艺术家，但是呢，啊，Damien Hirst的最多的这个户外的艺术装置，其实是在我们的格林威治半岛。那比如说像这一座呃美人鱼的这个